hey, I just wanted to demo the JavaScript Instagram bot I've been working on. I used Meteor and Vue for the front and back end, and I used Google's Puppeteer to set up server side uh, instances of Chromium uh, and run them headlessly, uh, which will be used to navigate for Instagram, like, follow, and comment on people's pictures. I'm just going to go ahead and demo that for you. Just launch the browser, press run. First thing it will do, it will attempt to log into Instagram using predetermined credentials. If the login is successful, it will save the cookies and we'll use those for the remainder of the session. I think exactly that has happened. And we'll move on then to the routine of first thing and following people. Then we're going to move ahead to the tag. Travel this time, pick a random image. Oh. Go to the user, grab their stats, and see if they're within the thresholds. I think this one will be. So we'll like, follow, drop a comment, close the session, move on to the next one. So just to run the Chromium headlessly, we can navigate to the settings and untick the box to show the browser. We can actually disable showing the images as well. We'll save a lot of bandwidth. We can um, also set the common seed separated by commas. Uh, we can use the, uh, the tags, uh, which are predetermined here. Uh, we can actually set up some uh, thresholds for, for the activities. So we can set up how many likes, follows, or comments we would like to issue per hour. We can set the following comment rate, uh, number of unfollows per day, uh, we can also set some settings um, when we look into the user stats. Uh, here we're only interested in users that have 10 or more uh, posts in their accounts. Uh, we don't want to follow anybody who have more than two and a half thousand followers. And same goes for following. We can actually individually disable some specific activities like liking, following, or commenting. I'm going to get back to the uh, dashboard. Um, now uh, the routine is running headlessly, so we don't see any Chromium popping up uh, on the bottom. Um, but we can see that activities are being processed from the logs here. Uh, we can see what the recent activities uh, have uh, have been uh, have been processed. So likes, follows, and comments, and some general stats uh, on likes, follows, and follows and comments. Um, so we can see that the browser is running and processing a task uh, and it will run the loop every five seconds uh, and if the task has finished it will begin the new routine um, using the settings and um, and yeah I think that's the bot in action if you have any questions feel free to ask those in the question box below uh, and I will be happy to answer those thanks for watching bye